to a single colossal oculus without lids, without face, without brow, without halo of marginal flesh. Man is finally limited now. And without any fear, having glanced at the earth, quite unlike the old freak that was dappled all over with seas and smiled at the sun on one cheek, not mountains he sees and not waves, not some gulf that brilliantly shines, and not the silent old cinema of clouds and grain fields and vines, and of course not a part of the parlour with his kin's leaden faces. Oh, no, no, in the stillness of his revolutions, nothing in that respect will he know. Gone, in fact, is the break between matter and eternity. And who can care for a world of omnipotent vision? if nothing is monogrammed there. Hmm?